Hi everyone, I'm Chippy K, and in this video, I'll show you how to save your projects to share with others. So, in the last video, I showed you how to save your rapid script into a PDF file that can be executed on the robot. If you would like to save your project in a way that it can be opened by someone else with Robot Studio, you have to open a file tab, select the sharing tab and save it as a pack and go file. This would save your project and compress it into a single file that can be opened by any person with Robot Studio. You can also add a password to it to protect the file. Also, if you like to um, share your project with someone that has not got Robot Studio but you like them to view your project well, and they have got Windows, you could save it as a viewer and if you save it as a viewer, I'll show you the seven downloads. I would I would save it as a file that can be that can be started by the user without Robot Studio and it just shows goes straight into the simulation view and the user can basically move around the the view. And this does not need Robot Studio to actually work. Then you can also create a system backup. So under your contro controller, you can right click on your robot and you can create a backup. So backup would basically save everything that's stored on the robot controller. So that's the the rapid scripts, the IO configurations and all the settings that you'd have on the robot. This is essential if you're planning to share the robot with different users because um, another user could change something in one of the configurations on the robot and that might affect the way your script actually runs so you may want to create a backup so that whenever you get to work on a robot you can restore your backup using restore backup and and continue from where you were last where you last stopped okay so that will be it for this video thank you for watching